Hello, everybody, to the uh, the melon craft new oh, 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 hey. uh, You you aren't doing this, aren't you? Come no. here. <sighs> Uh, well, I'm taking up the news now, bitch, again! <laughs> uh, Alright. That, yeah. That was chaotic. I guess I'll explain at the end. But, wait, where's the list? Uh, oh, here's the list. <laughs> yeah, the whole list. Okay, so. Nowadays, I actually have a lot to catch up on. But I guess I'll look up the script. Oh, the base expansion. So, apparently, Bill's mine, and someone else's. Who is that person? Oh, oh, Charles, a bit smudged out. Um, they had a base expansion just recently. I guess we'll check it out later, but for now, we're, go we're gonna have to leave it. Or actually, we could just look at those maps over there. What is this place? Anyways, continuing on. You, we have... The Nexus. Basically, Thomas's base, apparently, has received a build an expansion to res to hold out the Nexus. The thing that literally sent me to... Wait. No. The Nexus didn't send me. That person did. That person did. Oh, okay. Um... Uh, <laughs> In Thomas's base, it's now used to contain the Nexus, which is starting to expand, but it's starting to overexpand itself, so it's really just starting to derange the madness, apparently. We have the new areas, the Reactor, uh, Will's TARDIS, and a few others which are smudged out for some reason. In this case, I'll talk about Will's TARDIS, which is now dead and his blood is strewn all over the place. My beautiful pickaxe, you did the best. Um, World Star this. <sighs> well, it in a way it did what Yan could never do. Well, it, well, <laughs> I've got paranoia now. <laughs> I cannot really talk about it, otherwise you might come from the roof, just like Yan tried to do. Um, a few episodes ago. And I can't really talk about it, otherwise Yan will probably come from the roof and try and massacre me. Uh, hey, let's just not- let's not talk about what happened all those days ago. Years. Wait, that was two years ago. Yeah, that's a long way ago. Anyways. World's TARDIS has been upgraded to travel through time and now through other universes. So potentially we could now hold our experiments within the rooms. I don't want to dive in there again, to be quite honest. Now, um, Memorial Vi Village. Memorial Village is a nut. I've actually been to that place once. Well, in a bit of a dream while I was in the back rooms, if you get what I mean. Um, it was mostly talking about, I was, it's about like Minecraft was 0.5, a few others, Minecraft 0, a few of the family servers, Thomas was in, Sarah. To be honest, I'd actually love to live there, just saying, and also that clock tower, it looks oddly familiar. Um, we got breaking news for this part. I have no idea what this breaking news is, but I guess I'll look at, try and look for the smudged letters now. Uh, oh, it looks like it's just to pass over to Charlie. Um, camera man, pass it over to Charlie right now, or else you die. Thank you, Bruno. I'm Charlie, and I'm at Memorial Clock Tower. And I have an announcement to make. Phil, I'm starting a war on you. Don't ask for a reason. I just feel like starting a war on you, Phil. <gasps> Anyways. Okay, that's all. Back to you, Bruno.
All right, thanks, Charlie. Holy crap, chill out there, dude. Jan's bet, I mean, well, in this case, Phil is not going to have a good... Just saying. Well, okay. Now we have, um... I think, I, think uh -oh. I should intervene here. Uh, uh, well, well, uh, can I... welcome to the stage, please. Uh, wait. Uh, hey, hey. Uh, hi. Hey, you. Hey. Guys, you sit on the stairs. Come on. Uh, oh, right. yeah, sorry, I no. guess we'll sit down together. Uh -huh. <clears throat> mm. Wasn't me, it was him. Yeah, it wasn't me as well, it was him. Um, what were we about to talk about? Um, we were talking about, oh, right. Um, looking at the news script that is oddly smudged out by someone. Um, well, I got on it. Chill out, my dude. Um, hey, no, we have Chris. Jennifer, Grace, and Maisie. And what From what I heard, they've been. So, this is. I'm about to go to the news. I'm gonna have a new segment called The Return. In this case, how I returned from another reality. Well, in between. It all started when the Nexus blew up. We all know what happened over there. Show the clip for a second. The nuke just came through. Oh, did it? Did it? Oh, I don't see yeah. it. I do see a bit of red. Oh. That's not good. I can see that as well. But what happened to it? Well, well, what did you say? Did anything happen? I, it came through and then it just disappeared. You don't think it... Wait. No, it... What the... Whoa. Uh, it, it worked? Why are you looking at me when you say shirt clip, huh? Your mum. What? All right, so that was honestly, you know, that's uh, yeah, <laughs> traumatic if I'm being completely honest. Um, I got sent back. I got sent to the back rooms by a strange blue-suited man. He was I all the way back then. He offered me to get more research out of my experiments with teleportation. In this case, um. You know, just get more results, more actually, he actually gave more equipment, a few random ass textbooks from the future, you know. Now, he had said that apparently I've earned back, not really true to be quite honest, since I got sent to the back rooms. That, you know, was also traumatic. So, I landed on the freaking weird ass moisted carpet. The moisted carpet was just honestly disgusting. I continued on from the through the holes in my well in the remains of my armor, which was now basically destroyed from the Nexus, Nexus explosion. I was wandering around the halls for a little bit and found myself against. It was a little bit of a dog creature. I have no time to explain it, but a, a dog creature that tried attacking me. It was similar to like a wolf, but that's what I could say. I killed it, of course, and continued on with my life. And I found the continuation of level zero. Well, level zero onto level one. Level one was a type of, well, it is a type of like warehouse, if you get what I mean. Concrete walls, piled floors, low hanging flog, so, continuing on from the story, instead of describing the levels, I, after I made it into level 1, I continued on to the hub, which is a huge tunnel that... Not not that hub, okay? Not that hub. I mean, yeah, but you, you didn't specify, so... Yeah, the hub is a long... The, the, <laughs> the, the, the hub... The, the, the hub... The hub is a long tunnel. That I know what else basically is on the hub. <laughs> basically, the tunnel or the hub is a long tunnel that leads to any level within the back. In this case, I wanted to go to 
So I wanted to go to level 69, but for some reason my mic kept on cutting out. It's unfortunate, but still, my mic is can be pretty trash sometimes, but okay. Guess what? My car was on it uh, was upside down when I made it to level 3. I uh, made it to level 3. Okay, well, let me actually put some backstory to this. I first went to level 3 and got into a car that was... Uh, I lost consciousness within the car, as it states within some of the wikis. And I woke up in the car that was unfortunately upside down. I got out the car to try and reflip it around and... I got taken by an entity that was kind of like spider or crab legs. The image will appear right next, uh, right next to me, from the photograph I took. Anyways, it swept me up into the, uh, it swept me up, and I travelled through a few places, mostly nostalgic memories, and I ended up up there. Somewhere's up there. So that's my story to how I got back. So this is a true goodbye to you viewers, well, not a true goodbye in the sense of the last video, but a true goodbye of finally ending this video, so, goodbye people. Holy shit. How'd you, how'd you place down a boat again? Ah, M.O.D. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna get it. I didn't realise how close I was to dying right then. No! I'm in the boat with Bruno. <laughs> Hi! No, I wanna... Hey, Daddy. Hi, Daddy. <laughs> I'll beat you. I'll um, beat you. Well, I actually pulled down my so fucking earphones again. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> nice warm up. Beer, I want oh. it. <laughs> That's all she said. Fuck you, Thomas. <laughs> Do what? <laughs> what? Oh, uh, oh, oh. Come on, Thomas. <laughs> 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 oh, oh um, hell, Jesus! Uh, uh, yeah. Does this place have free food afterwards? Yes. He is one of one. He is one of one. He is Nazi.